went around asking people we know, asking people we don't know, asking people of friends. When you're going to be 18 by November, or either you're already 18, to sign up to vote, we tell them that it's important that their voices are heard, and I think that boosts their confidence. All of us are senior leaders here at Johnson, and just by us having that, that role in our school, we can really spread out a strong message about the importance of registering to vote. There are volunteers for National Voter Registration Day in communities across the country helping people get registered to vote. We had over 750,000 people register on this day in 2016 and we're hoping to have even more than that this year. We're celebrating National Voter Registration Day and that's critical for us because nothing changes if we don't vote. You absolutely must register. You absolutely must participate. I brought all my government classes down here. I really stress the importance of voting and, and how their decisions can make actual differences in their lives and their community. This time of year I teach units on elections and political parties, kind of help them figure out where they stand and what their beliefs are. We did a training yesterday at Como. We're working with OWL, so we're trying to get a lot of the schools in St. Paul involved and also some schools in Minneapolis. What we're hoping to bring to the students is is not only to get them registered, but we're trying to teach them how to register their peers who are 18, how to register their parents, their neighbors, and other members of their community. Our voices are important to hear. We are young, and I feel like us as a generation should change the world. For us young adults, we do have our opportunity to speak out uh, for what we believe, and I want uh, us young adults out here to make this uh, community a better place too.